Hi guys, I'm creating this video to help you solve some potential problems you'll get whilst creating 3D images on Facebook. Now the first one we're going to look at is when a part of your foreground gets stuck to your background. As we can see here, I've made this wasp and he's got a few hairs on his back and uh, it's stuck to the background. So if we look at my depth map picture, we can see I've got some fine details in the hair here. And Facebook doesn't like that. So if we go to the next picture, we can see the bits where the hair is getting stuck, I've extended that out and I've blurred them and tried to blend them very slightly to give it a bit more support when it's being rendered by Facebook. So now, if we try to upload these, I'll just show you quickly. Here I've got the first example with the fine detailed depth map picture and we can see the hair is stuck to the background. And then if we go forward to the next one, we can see it works out a lot better. Another problem you have, sometimes when you upload your pictures, you may just get two images instead of the 3D box that Facebook gives you when it's merging them together. To, to sort this problem out, we're going to come back and have a look at our original files. And we can see here I spelt wasp wrong. So I'm going to change the word. So I'm going to go right click, rename, and I'm going to correct the spelling. I'll re upload that and that should work fine. Now, the same problem, we've uploaded the pictures and the 3D box hasn't merged them together. So again, we're gonna to have to go back to our files and have a look. Now, if we look at the top left here, we can see this is a TIFF image. So I'm gonna to go to File, Save As, and we need to make sure this is a JPEG or PNG. So I've saved this as a PNG. I already have one saved here, this shouldn't happen to you. I'm gonna go back to my files and if you come to this stage and you right click and go to properties you can see the file type it's a tiff that's no good so i've deleted that the next problem is it's failed to create your 3d photo now you've done everything else right you can't work out what's wrong here's an example of a very busy depth map picture there's a lot of detail in there there's a lot of black whites and grays it's um it's really difficult for Facebook to make this into anything, it's just far too detailed. So if we upload it, you can see this happening here. I've sped this up a lot. We wait a long time. And then we get this message. There's no real way around this other than just redesigning your image or redesigning the way you want it to be 3D. So everyone, I hope this has solved at least some people's problems. There's obviously a lot more out there. I can't cover all of them. But if I come up with any more, I'll give it a go. Uh, if this has helped you, please like the video. It's a huge support to me and it motivates me to make some more. Let me know what you think. Drop your comments in the comments section below. If you'd like to just know how to create one and create a depth map picture, it might be worth checking out my other video, Making a 3D Image on Facebook.